awesome person, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, that's awesome, then just welcome to my channel. My name is Joy, I do unboxings, makeup try-ons, and I throw in all kinds of things to keep you on your toes. And today is another Mask Monday. And I think I am going to use this Generation Clay Ultraviolet Brightening Purple Clay Mask. I've used it a couple of times now and I just absolutely love it. And this was sent to me by Gracefully Cheryl and a friend mail. So I had to try it out immediately because it was purple. <laughs> so how is everybody doing today? I hope we're all doing well. So who's ready for Thanksgiving this year? It's pretty simple for me because I'm not the one cooking. I just have to drive. Oh, I didn't think about that hat I was choosing to wear. But, oh well. I get a little bit on it. No biggie. But anyways, all I have to do is drive. And I'm not even going to be the one driving. My husband will be. We're going to go to my daughter's, my oldest daughter's. And look at some of it's already drying. <laughs> mm. It does dry pretty fast, especially thin layers. Okay, I guess we'll call that good. Yeah, I'm just using my camera to see. Okay, 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 well. I normally do this in the bathroom too, so. I forget stuff like towels or whatever. Good thing I've got me wipes here. Yeah, makeup wipes. This stuff just wipes right off, right after it's done, just to let cloth. And, but I don't want it to dry on my lips. So, I always take it off. Okay. Alrighty, so back to what I was saying. I think that's so funny how that's already drying, huh? Oh, so back to what I was saying. My husband's gonna drive us to my daughter's house and I get to have a relaxed full Thanksgiving and sit back and enjoy the meal that she prepares and if she needs my help, then of course I'll help her. If not, I'm just gonna let her do the mom thing and cook the food and I'm gonna sit down and relax and visit with whoever shows up at her house. I guess I never noticed before how quick this dries because I normally put it on and then go sit down. But I guess that is what it is. Super weird though, looking at it drying. Huh, cool. I think it's cool anyways. So today, I thought that I would tell you guys how I met my husband. I met him back in 2012 and he was renting a room from my uncle, Freddie, and I didn't know this. And my cousin, Teresa, was renting an apartment from my uncle, Freddie, which I knew. And the house, it was like a big house, and the downstairs was a one-bedroom apartment, and then the upstairs was like, it would have been like a five-bedroom apartment, but instead he rented that out like individually as rooms, so um, I believe my husband was paying 100 bucks a week to rent a room out, and then they had access to like the living room and, you know, the kitchen and all that. So I had no clue that my uncle did that. I did know that he rented the um, little apartment down stairs and that my cousin moved in and so she was there for a couple of months I guess and I decided to go ahead and go visit her and it was let me think May May of 2012 and my I was with my mom 
and we were sitting outside on my cousin's picnic table waiting for her to get back from wherever she was at doing whatever she was doing she had no idea we were coming but we did um text her and she was like i'm on my way home just you know don't leave wait for me so that's what we were doing so while we were waiting um this man this gorgeous six foot three man i didn't know he's six foot three at the time but i knew he was tall but this gorgeous man come walking in between like there was a house and then there was like a garage type thing and he come walking in between to go to the lake because they lived um the house was on a channel to get to the lake and he's pulling a grill because my uncle had rules like they he didn't want people grilling i guess too close to the house or whatever they had to move it away smart so that way you know nothing catches on fire but anyways so he's pulling this grill and i'm just like and my mom's like, Joy, <laughs> she's like, quit staring. And I'm like, Mom, I'm like, I can't help it. So anyways, I caught his attention. He caught my attention. We didn't talk to each other. About that same time, my cousin showed up and we went into her house and we visited with her for a little bit. And when we left, he was no longer downstairs. But while I was there, I found out that he rented from my Uncle Freddie. So later that night or the next day, I can't remember which, but um, my cousin Teresa, I text her and I was like, um, can you tell me that guy's name? And she was like, his name's David, but we call him Dave. And I'm like, okay. And I'm like, do you know how old he is? And she's like, just a minute, I'll go find out. And I'm like, what? She's like, I'm going to go ask him. He's upstairs right now. Well, so... And I knew there was nothing I could do at that point she was going to. So she did. She went to go ask him how old he was. And um, he was 37 at the time, I think. Let me think. How old was I? 32? Yeah, he was 37. I was 32 going on 33. And he had just turned 37. And um, so then I was like, does he have a girlfriend? And um, she's like, no, he don't have a girlfriend. And I'm like, is he looking for a girlfriend? <laughs> well, anyways... So she's just like, I'm going to give him your number because I'm tired of being the middleman. And I'm like, okay, like, that's cool. So like a couple minutes later, Dave texted me and we stayed up probably until like two or three in the morning, just texting each other. And then we both had to work at, he had to work at 8 a.m. I had to work at 9 a.m. So we definitely went to work that day, tired. And the next day, I don't think we really talked to each other much um, because we were just really tired. And then the third day that after we had met, um, we like talked on the phone phone, like actual conversation. And you know, people don't do that often these days. Um, but anyhow, we talked on the phone, actual conversation, and we were up until like two, three in the morning just talking. But anyhow, long story short, now we're here. Um, we are happily married. We have seven acres. We homestead. We're raising a huge family. Well, not so much anymore. We have nine children between the two of us. Five of them are adult children and five of them are adult children that do not live in our home. So we're down to the four last children that are 17, 16, 15, and 12 at the moment so not much longer and we're gonna be complete empty nesters and I mean I just want to travel and not have to pay for extra kids I'm I'm selfish yeah I know um, but children are expensive and the older they get the ruder they are and the more ungrateful they are and I'm strict on my kids so I don't think it matters if you're a strict parent or if you're not a strict parent I think all teenagers just go through that I think my parents are dumb and I'm better than them stage and um, yeah so not much longer and it'll just be me and my husband his hobbies and my makeup <laughs> um, it's my hobby right now at the moment alrighty well I think I'm gonna go ahead and pause y'all because this is pretty dry and it says that, you know, not to leave it on for more than 10 minutes. 
and I'm at 10 minutes on my videos, so I'm gonna go ahead and wash her off and I'll be right back. Hey, I am back and let me get a little closer. Now, I don't know <laughs> because this new phone that I'm using to record with, it's really freaky. As I get closer, I change colors, but I'm gonna try. I like it. I don't really make my skin shine or anything that much, which is nice. And it's nice and smooth and I feel super clean. I really enjoy it. So if you like these type of, and they wash off so easily, like just get your um, rag wet, wipe it off, and then you can, you know, take a handful of water afterward and just, you know, do that to your face and um yeah it's clean and no mess or anything so i really love things that do not make messes but generation clay um ultra violet brighting purple clay mask if you missed that earlier see what i talk about like get closer and it changes <laughs> all right well that is all I have for you for this Mask Monday. I hope you enjoyed it. Hope you have a wonderful day. Remain awesome. Peace.